All right, guys, there's the new. Oh, my. Okay. Got it. What's going on, everybody? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. I am in Grand Isle, Louisiana. Uh, my buddy Justin and I came down here to fish. If you don't know where Grand Isle is, if you look at the Mississippi River, follow it all the way to where it dumps down the ocean, and look at Louisiana below uh, New Orleans, and watch the road until it runs out. And that's where we are. It's like 20 miles of bridges just to get here and there's water everywhere and it's supposed to be one of the best fisheries anywhere. So we came down here to see, see what we could do. We booked these, this little cabin to stay at like eight or nine months ago. So we've had this trip planned for a while. Today's Thursday, it's about 4.30. We're gonna go out, put out some crab pots, fish this afternoon. And then we have all of Friday and all of Saturday to fish and drive home on Sunday. So. We got two full days and a little bit of fish and everything I've heard about this place is amazing. Uh, Justin's dad came down here last year and fished with a friend of his and they just caught some monster black drum and red drum and had a great time. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fish hard. Hopefully we can catch a whole pile of fish and it should be a lot of fun. So stick around and let's see what happens. running some fish up here. Huh? I'm talking to the camera. Oh, look at this other one coming. <laughs> They're everywhere out here. Crazy. All right, guys, we're in our first spot for the day. We, uh, I just caught a pretty good black drum, but I didn't have the camera on, so didn't really get that one. But we had to ride all over looking for bait and finally got a bunch of crabs to use and some mud minnows so we're gonna keep fishing and hopefully we can get on them pretty good here. Y'all don't understand how big that net is. That's the dang stud. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. All right, I gotta pick this thing up. All right, guys, we just weighed him. It's a little bit over 20. <laughs> Gonna put it back now. goes fish on right, this is Justin's first one of the trip what do I need to do with my lines you This one over here for now. Hopefully, nothing takes it away. He didn't hammer it either. Feels pretty solid. Guys, we just caught a whole pile in a row. Didn't get a whole bunch of video. There you go. <laughs> That's 
absolutely smoking them. So I forgot my GoPro, but we just, we've caught five now in 30 minutes or less than 30 minutes. Two 20 pounders and probably three between 12 and 15. It's pretty good. You big? Huh? Dang, look at that boat. That thing is blue as heck. This might be a pretty good fish here. on them so there's a little drop off out here in front of us and we're fishing on the edge of the drop off it goes from like 9 to 20 feet or so <clears throat> and they must be just kind of cruising cruising this drop off oh he's not as he's not huge we're getting spoiled now it's... There he is. Had to put the camera down to do work on him. Guys, when I tell you we're smoking them, I am not, I'm not telling stories. I mean, this is unbelievable right now. Yes, sir. Number 10 in an hour. That one might be pretty solid there. other folks that left must not have been using the right bait. <laughs> you're under me, I think. Yeah. You're under me. You want me to move my rod to the other side? How tight you got the drag, dang. It hasn't come loose or something? Uh-uh, I keep tightening it up. Dang.
That's a good one. Real good. You want the grabber? Yeah, go ahead. All right, guys, here's another one. It was right around 34, 20 pounds. There he goes. We're absolutely wearing the fish out. This is number 18. It's been fast and furious for the most part. in the anchor rope. That's a smaller one there. There you go. Back to back. <laughs> you would turn off the camera. <laughs> Fish on. <laughs> that one might be a little more sporty there. All right, I gotta turn the camera off to get this fish out of the net. There we go, we got one. Justin just caught that one. That one's about 15 pounds. That one's probably about 10. The circle hooks are working really well. Everyone we've put back has, or we put all of them back and everyone we put in the water is just straight off. So, man, it's been a darn good day. We at 19 now? Yeah, 19. That, was, that was 18, that's 19. So we're at 20 and we have less than three hours invested in fishing today. We're up to 20 fish now, and our biggest one was that one, which was 37 and a half inches, and we're at, weighed right at 30 pounds. We are wearing them out. We're fishing with blue crab pieces, anything from claws to just pieces of the body, and it's going really well. We came out here about a mile from where we were. There's this little like tower thing. I think it like measures tide, and there's this flat out here. It's only like five or six feet and they're all on this flat. So it's pretty darn good right now. Well guys, Justin is hooked up again and I haven't been recording, but we have caught so many fish that it's probably been the best day of fishing of my entire life. I didn't have my GoPro. So I've been recording here and there. This is number 36 fish. We've averaged a fish somewhere between 15 and 30 pounds every 10 minutes for four hours. And we're both sunburned, but we're happy. <laughs> we're almost out of bait, or what we're gonna allow ourselves to use today, because we got one more day left. So we're gonna, oh crap. <laughs> uh, good news, we got a whole bunch more rods. <laughs> That's what, that's what happens when you over, overwork a rod. <laughs> Dang. Where's the net at? You want me to just try it? Smoked it. <laughs> Dang. Broke it twice. He did break it twice. The tip's broken too. But there's another one that's pretty average what we've been catching. It's probably about 18 pounds. Crazy, crazy day. 
All right, guys, got a little Sunday. We're here in our little beach cabin that we, Justin and I rented, and uh, we're cooking some elk steaks. Um, so tomorrow I'm gonna take my GoPro. Today, I just had my camera, and I did the best I could, but honestly, we absolutely smoked the fish. I couldn't record everything. I couldn't record close to everything because the fishing was so unbelievable. We caught 37 black drum in just under six hours. They were all 27 to 37 inches. Only two were under 30 inches. So almost all of them were 30 to 37 inches. And uh, the vast majority were 18 to 22 pounds. So it was unbelievable. Tomorrow, it's supposed to be kind of windy. So in the morning, we're gonna go into a different area, kind of up into some creeks and stuff and fish, and maybe we can catch some reds and just see what happens. And then um, tomorrow afternoon, depending on what the weather's like, we might go back out there one more time. But we're just kind of gonna play it by ear and hopefully we, we do well and catch some fish. But so far, uh, it's been unbelievable. Today was probably the best day of fishing of my life. Just nonstop action on big fish. So maybe, hopefully tomorrow, even if tomorrow's not as good, it's still gonna be an unbelievable trip no matter what happens tomorrow. 